Hey guys, it's Tanya with Thrifty Treasures and today I'm taking you along with me for a ride along slash vlog. My car is loaded down with a ton of stuff. Um, I'm going to half price books. I have to go, I'm going to go drop some consignment off and I'm going to be going to the antique booth and I'm sure you know me, I'm going to hit a couple thrift stores. <laughs> so let's go. First stop, half price books. I like to come first thing in the morning because it's not real crowded. Oh my God, what is that truck doing over there? He is smoking. Good Lord. So um, I'm gonna get my books and see what they'll give me for them. Okay, I just finished up in Half Price Books and they gave me $30 for two bags of books. So that's cool. And um, that happened a lot faster than I thought it was. It's only 9.15. So uh, my next stop where I want to drop my um, consignment doesn't open until 10. So um, I guess I am going to waste some time and there's a, a Goodwill around here. So darn, I have to go to Goodwill. <laughs> All right. Okay, I just finished in that Goodwill. I spent about $20 and I'm gonna show you real quick what I got. So I bought this really tall trash can. It's got a real cute little golden retriever on it. And it's signed here on the bottom. It says, um, it's Ruan Manning, like Dwayne, but it's an R instead of a D, Ruan, Rain. I don't know, Manning. Anyway, um, I haven't looked it up or anything. I thought uh, I may, might put that in my antique booth. And then I picked up a book. It's called um, Grain Brain. I think the sales rank is like eight eight hundred eighty eight. So um, as soon as I list this, it's it's probably going to sell. It's not going for a ton of money. It's going for like eleven dollars used FBA, and I think maybe uh, maybe four uh, merchant fulfilled. So I'll probably send that into FBA, and it will probably sell as soon as it checks in, since it has such a low sales rank. Um, I picked up this. Secret Millionaires Club featuring uh, Warren Buffett. Um, this one I paid $1.99 for, and um, the sales rank was pretty low. I'm gonna send it to FBA, and um, there was no offers, used or new, so um, I'll probably put it up for maybe $39.99. And then I had to get this when I saw it. <laughs> A Furby! Isn't it cute? It's like new with tags and everything. So um, it says model 70-800. Um, I don't know if this one has a has a name on it or anything, but I paid five dollars for it. And I'm sure eventually I will sell it, but this makes the third one that we have at the house now. And so it's fun to turn them on. Uh, Madeline likes to play with them and then they kind of like talk back and forth with each other. It's crazy, so, but they're so cute. And then what else did I get? Oh, I love the animal planners uh, to put plants in. So I picked this up and I really, I like the finish on it. I love the color, but it has this, like see this here and then this was like, um, like an indention. So I don't know what this was originally used for but, um, and I paid $2 for it. You can see the little Roman numerals, but I am going to use it for a, uh, to put a plant in. But if you know what this was originally used for, I would love to hear your thoughts on it. <laughs> so, and then the last thing I got inside there was this really cute little monster purse. It's from Justice. Isn't it adorable? I got it for Madeline. Um, and if she doesn't want it, then I'll probably just sell it um, on eBay. I paid $3.99 for it, but oh my goodness, it was so stinking cute. I couldn't pass it up. So look, so then you open it up and there's a little, I guess that's like his little mouth. Isn't it cute? His little teeth. So cute. And it's got a pretty long strap on it. So I thought it might be good for her to put like, um, you know, some books or coloring books. Like whenever we go out to eat, um, you know, she usually brings a bag of, of things to do to keep her busy. So that's everything I got there and it's finally 10 o'clock. So now I am off to um, drop off some consignment. So let's go do that. 
Okay guys, I'm finally at the consignment shop and here are the items I'm bringing in. Okay, just dropped off my consignment and I wanted to show you what I picked up in there. I always seem to find something to buy. Um, so I picked up two Vera Bradley purses. This is the first one. It's real cute. It's a good size purse. I'd say, I'd say it's like a medium size purse, medium to large. And um, she took the price tag off, but I think this one was $5.50. And then I got this one, and I think this one was $6.50. So, um, and I didn't even do a ton of research. I didn't really look these up on eBay. I thought oh, they're really cute. I can at least double my money, I'm sure. I mean, worst case scenario, I can always put them in my antique booth. So now I am off to the next stop. Oh wait, before I leave, I wanted to tell you guys. Um, so the place where I can sign, um, I can drop consignment off every Tuesday and Friday. I can only bring 10 items in at a time and it's a 50-50 split. So, um, and then once a month I can pick up my check. And usually they don't price their items very high. I mean, I think the highest they put on, I've seen them put on something is maybe $10, but most clothes and shoes are like five and $6. So the most profit I stand to make usually off any one item is about, um, you know, anywhere from three to $4. So whenever I go to these garage sales or these like big church garage sales and I see clothing for a quarter and 50 cents, um, that's when I like to stock up on the good name brands and um, save them for whenever I bring stuff to consign. What are we doing? Okay, so Say I came hi. in to do the reseller stew real quick and here's Deb and April. Say hi. 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 <laughs> Okay, I'm back in the car running some more errands. Um, we just finished doing the reseller stew. And if you guys have never seen that, it's on um, Deb's channel, Painting Pesos. It comes on Tuesdays at noon. So um, that's always a lot of fun. And um, I was gonna go to the antique mall today, but it's getting late fast. So I think I'm gonna save that for tomorrow, but I'm gonna be bringing you a separate video on my antique booth, what's going to the antique booth. Um, probably tomorrow or um, Thursday and um, so I'm just gonna run to the grocery store and a couple other boring things that you guys would not be interested in so I hope you guys enjoyed my little vlog today um, my little ride-along please um, subscribe to me if you haven't already um, like the video share the video and um, comment and let me know what you guys have been up to thanks so much for watching bye guys